find out about the forecast for everybody else. What's going on? A lot better yet. The forecast sadly was far too correct. And since the early hours, this is a picture of what the radar picked up. The lime green is where you probably have seen flooding, not just in Barry, in Maidenhead later on in the morning, and just recently in the west of London. Now, that rain is falling in torrential amounts. Normally, if you see anything more than, say, four millimetres falling in an hour, that's very heavy rain. Well, Croydon had 34 in the last hour, and he threw 24. That's an inch of rain in an hour. You can see why flooding happened. Even up in Oxfordshire, you're talking about half an inch an hour, and still in the wall, we're back in the Cotswolds, aren't we? By the middle of the afternoon, the heaviest rain would have cleared a bit further north. The sun's already out in London. I'm not sure that Barry's out of the woods just yet. The lime green and the yellow is still where the heavy rain is, so we're into the South Midlands here, North Wiltshire, that sort of area. And still the line takes you further west, so Bath, maybe Bristol, and again, South East Wales, wet areas. But really, all of southern Brit Britain, with the exception of Cornwall, has a Met Office severe weather warning right up until this evening. They'll probably be extended beyond that. In the rain, of course, it's cold and quite windy. Outside the rain, it's only a bit warmer in Cornwall. Though I have to say, Northern England, Scotland and Northern Ireland haven't been doing too badly. Now, overnight tonight, the rain moves slowly north and becomes a bit lighter, but it's still fairly persistent. And if you get an idea of the shape, it is still curled around a centre of low pressure, which is the cause of it all. That centre at the moment is over London. But Saturday, I have to say, looks a better day. Not hugely brilliant, but better. For example, by the end of the afternoon, it'll still likely be cloudy in northern England and raining quite possibly in Carnoustie. And have a poor day. Sunday looks promising. Let's hope we can all enjoy Sunday. But this is Saturday. And Saturday afternoon, still a grey uh, picture. You'll notice that for northern England, northeast England, it's dry. May have been a wet night, but it's dry by day. The warmth of the sunshine will prompt some more showers tomorrow in the same areas that are currently flooded in southern England, but these showers will move along a bit faster, there's a bit more of a breeze, and they shouldn't be overly heavy. Southwest England, still enjoying the best of the sunshine, particularly Cornwall. Wales, there could still be a problem here. This area of rain may have lasted since the early morning, so persistent rain in Wales is a possibility. Northern Ireland's day on Saturday isn't brilliant, still a northeast wind and with increasing cloud and rain. Now, Sunday should promise us a bit of sunshine and a few showers and a bit more warmth, so that's the better day. But for the time being, and until well into this evening, southern Britain has a severe weather warning for heavy rain. Please. Well, Rob, thanks very much.